Congestion and left turns slow travel and reduce safety on this busy stretch of Highway 49, which is also known as University City Boulevard along the campus of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte. Every day, students are going to class and tens of thousands of commuters take the route, which is right off I-485. The Charlotte Region Transportation Planning Organization has requested the road be widened. The boulevard now carries more than 40,000 vehicles a day on average, and more people are expected to use the road as the area continues to grow. The North Carolina Department of Transportation has proposed adding a travel lane in each direction between John Kirk Drive and Pavilion Boulevard to further improve traffic flow and safety for drivers and pedestrians alike the department would use an innovative design known as a reduced conflict intersection as part of the widening. The department is using the design more and more around the state as an effective way to reduce congestion and improve safety. At John Kirk Drive, drivers needing to go left or straight instead would turn right onto NC 49, go a short distance, then make a U-turn from a dedicated turn lane. Drivers on NC 49 would go straight left or right at those locations. A reduced conflict intersection simplifies how traffic moves through the area, often providing more green time for the main road and allowing people to reach their destination more quickly and safely. Pedestrian safety would be at the forefront of this proposed project. Paved multi-use trails would be built along both sides of the widened road and the U-turn locations would also provide for students to use signalized crosswalks in addition to those planned at major intersections. The same reduced conflict intersection design has reduced delays and improved safety at three intersections in Holly Springs, a town outside Raleigh. Town officials say the travel time on the NC-55 bypass has been cut in half, and they have seen a sharp drop in vehicle crashes since the reduced conflict intersections were opened in 2013. Mayor Dick Sears says some residents were skeptical at first. But the traffic now is much better. It's cleaner, it gets through better. The accident rate is way, way down. The backups are way, way down. A reduced conflict intersection is the right way to go left. It's a safer, smoother experience to help drivers reach their destination more quickly.